Good Wednesday evening, Midlands. I'm Chief Meteorologist Efren Afonte. Today's temperatures really weren't that bad. In downtown Columbia, we start off a low of 59 degrees and the Columbia Metropolitan Airport, a low of 60, close enough to the average. Both though reached a high temperature of 80 degrees. We still were dealing with a little bit of the haze from the smokes from Canada, but it wasn't too bad, and at least we weren't smelling it as much. It was 79 degrees, a little bit of cloud coverage, but the noticeable thing is that the relative humidity, 23%, very dry air, thanks to northerly winds at about seven miles an hour. It was a really nice start to the evening. And again, not a lot of cloud coverage, just the haze. The clouds were surrounding the Palmetto State, but as we go into the overnight hours, a little bit of the clouds that are coming in from the west will filter in. So in the morning, we'll start off a low of 59 degrees. Winds will be out of the northeast at 5, picking up to about 15 miles in the afternoon. And with those partly sunny skies, we'll reach a high of 79. Now again, we've been tracking this stubborn area of low pressure. It is now positioned in the east central portion of the Gulf of Mexico. The stationary boundary goes right over Florida, and that's all where all the rain is. This is still expected to track across the floor, across right through Florida, and then make its way up the southeast coastline, which includes us, which means we've got a better chance of rain, and it is increasing by the day. On Friday, it'll be very cloudy. We're looking at a high of 75 degrees, then scattered showers for at least half of us, and we could be dealing with some heavy rainfall. Saturday, we're going to reach a high of only 66 degrees. Then on Sunday, as that area of low pressure gets a little bit closer to Wilmington, North Carolina, we're looking at possible storms, maybe some brief downpours with a high of 70. By Monday, it starts tracking up the Outer Banks, so we'll have a chance for thunderstorms for some of us, at least in the first half of the day, on Memorial Day Monday with a high of 76. But by midweek, the rain shuts off, more sunshine comes back, and so do the 80-degree temperatures for high on Tuesday and Wednesday.